Good morning everyone. Sorry for a little bit of a late start, a few technical difficulties with our internet connection, but we are with you now. Uh, I want to welcome you to our Key Stage 2 Assembly. In this assembly you are going to hear everything you need to know about return to school next week. We are super excited that you will be coming back to school next week. We can't wait to see you all, but of course there's a few things that we need to inform you about first. I want to say a massive thank you to all of the parents who have supported and helped with home learning for all of the children in school. You have been absolutely magnificent. Thank you so much for everything you've done. We've just had some fantastic parents evening, so thank you for brilliant attendance at those. Uh, we really, really appreciate your support. Um, you're going to get some more information from Mrs Field in just a second. Um, I just want to say we're really looking forward to seeing you coming back. You need to be attending school. You have to be coming back into school. So we look forward to seeing all of you back on Monday, ready to start learning. We can't wait to see you. We're going to send a little bit more information out today via ePres, via text, but please make sure that the place to go for all the information that you need is our website, which is ipsyacademy.co.uk. So I'm going to hand over now to Mrs Field, who's going to give you lots and lots of details. Come and see me, come and say hello on Monday. Can't wait to see you. Hello, good morning. It is fabulous to speak to you. We are so, so, so excited about you coming back to school. Um, I don't know if some of you are seeing this live, but you, we were re recording it, so we will get it on the website so that you can watch it afterwards. So one of the things I need to first of all start saying about is your start time. You are probably going to have to get up a little bit earlier now. Year five, your start time is 20 past eight. So you need to be here at 20 past eight for the latest half past eight so that you're ready for your lessons and year six it is half past eight so you need to be here by 20 to 9 so that your lessons are starting coming back to school wear your full uniform okay so look for that tie that's hidden somewhere in a corner look for your blazer find your odd shoe make sure that you've got everything you need and above all else wear black socks um, so you need to make sure that you've got everything that you are looking beautiful. Make sure you've got a coat. We will be ventilating all the classrooms. And as you know, the weather isn't as good as it was last weekend. So it's still quite cold. So make sure you've got your coat with you. Now, those same things are in place from before Christmas where you do need to have your own equipment. So please make sure you've got your own equipment. We do have at least a pencil for every single person because I ordered over 300 off Amazon uh, last week. So there is that for you, but you need to make sure you're having your own equipment and you are not sharing it with anyone else so that we are keeping everyone as safe as possible. OK, so when you come into school, you'll be using the same pathways as you used before. Basically, everything that's the same as before Christmas. But you're going to have to work really hard to try and remember what it was like, because I know that I've had to work really hard to try and remember that myself. OK, you will be back to your normal timetable that you had before. OK, so your creative lessons will be the same. Your lessons with your class teacher will be exactly the same. Your teachers are going to e-praise those out to you after this assembly okay telling you what your timetable is monday will be class based we thought it would be really really great if you're with your teacher for the whole day so there will be no creatives so you don't need to wear your PE kit and you just need to make sure you come in and you're ready to learn we have got a surprise for you um, in the morning a nice little welcome for you but your teachers might tell you about that you keep it as a surprise ready for you on monday morning you're going to be in the same classroom. You will have the same rules as before and your teachers will tell you about what your seating plan is. We will be expecting absolutely amazing behaviour as you already have shown us, but it's going to be a little bit harder because I know that some of you on calls have spoken over each other because it's really hard on teams to be able to tell when people are going to speak. Even the teachers do that in their meetings. Um, and, but you're going to have to learn those things. We are going to have to be social distancing, washing hands, sanitising hands, but your teachers will go through that all with you on Monday morning. The one way systems are in place. We've always had those in key stage two anyway, but we've got the arrows to show you. You need to be keeping to those. So you're not clashing with people. Your bags and your coats will be in your classroom. Please do not bring anything to school that you don't need. OK, so I don't want to see any teddies. I don't want to see squishy things and I don't want to see anything that shouldn't be in school. OK, just your equipment that you need and your lunch and a drinks bottle. 
If you are going to bring your mobile phone to school, it needs to be switched off and at the bottom of your bag. And I know that's going to be really hard because you guys have been able to have your phone next to a computer the whole time. Same goes for the teachers. They're going to have to have their, their phones away now and they're used to having it right next to them. OK, so make sure there's that. Now, um, lunch on Monday and Tuesday. If you usually have a hot meal, then um, I'm afraid there's not going to be hot meals provided by the canteen on Monday and Tuesday because we're not allowed to go into the hall. Because of the what's going on in Key Stage 3 and it's slightly different to Key Stage 2 starting school, then um, there aren't going to be, we can't go into the hall at all. So what's going to happen is that there's going to be a grab bag lunch. So that'll be a sandwich, some fruit, a cake, a drink. So if you want to have that, that's absolutely fine. You pay the normal way. If you're free school meals, then you would get that anyway. But if you want to bring a, a lunchbox for those two days instead of having a hot meal, we would recommend that so you've got your food. We'll still be eating in the classroom, so you won't be moving around very much. It will still be outside for lunch uh, break first and then eating afterwards. So everything's going to be the same. But for those two days, there won't be any hot meals. OK, if you've got any questions about that, please ask us and we'll just let you know. Um, some of the staff are going to be wearing masks. You will see the teachers wearing masks in the areas as we had it before. Key stage three staff will be wearing them as well if you see them around and some of the key stage three children will be wearing masks as well. OK, you don't have to wear a mask. But if you want to, because that's going to make you feel comfortable, you can, but you don't have to at all. OK, that's that you need to be ready for learning. Now, I know that it's going to be really, really difficult. What I'm going to say to you now is have an early night on Sunday night. I know I'm not going to sleep on Sunday night very well because I'm going to be too excited to see you guys and you're going to sit, feel exactly the same. But maybe for the next couple of nights, try and get an early night so you can have a good sleep. Have a good breakfast on Monday morning so that you are ready to start your learning. So you are going to concentrate. OK, um, but that little surprise I was talking about might involve a little bit of a breakfast, so you might be OK. So home time will be 3 p.m. for year five and quarter past three for year six. OK, I think I've said everything I need to say. All this information is going to be that I've told you today is going to be on the website is going to be sent out in various messages today. Your teachers are going to send you out a message and this assembly, fingers crossed that it has been recorded, will be on the website later on today. Above all else, we can't wait to see you. So stay safe. Come in on Monday morning, bright and breezy, smiling, even if it's a fake smile. Keep smiling and we look forward to seeing you then.